Remember, shift F2. Yes. Again, so intuitive. Look, she's she's admiring him take a high resolution photo of a bird of paradise that is not actually a bird of paradise. I guess that might just be an orchid that's supposed to be inspired by the bird of paradise. I don't know. It's a weird looking flower. The debate rages on. Huh? The debate rages on. You, you, you rage on. Yep. Is it a fedora or a trilby? That? What he's wearing? No. no. The, the, the debate that truly rages on. Oh. Uh, no, that, I mean, a, a fedora and a trilby are definitely distinct hats. Just most people mistake a, a fedora for a trilby. Other way around. People mistake trilbies for fedora. Yeah, that's what I meant. You're absolutely 100% right. Tja, yeah, because I would never be one of those people, because I know my hats. I only have six fedoras. I only have three trilbies, thank you very much. And two trench coats. I have none of these things. I actually don't own a trench coat. Um... Or, I, I, own, I own a cowboy hat, I don't own a... Alright, be real, how many katanas do you have? Uh, two, and they were given to me. I gotta be honest, I wasn't expecting that answer. I was just continuing with the meme, but, you know, I'm, 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 I'm proud of you for owning up to it, even if it was just a simple fact of somebody gifting it to you. It wasn't even so much as a gifting as a, hey, I'm moving out of state. I'm not going to bring these with me. Do you want them? Sure. I could use a letter opener. Basically. No. That kind of thing. I mean, they're pieces of crap. They're, I mean, they're not good for anything. They're, not, they're like, they're not even qualified. Quali they wouldn't even qualify as a showpiece. Really? It's, uh... The uh, person yeah. who gave it to you's grandfather didn't take it off a dead Japanese soldier in World War II? No, that's definitely what happened. It's just that that Japanese soldier purchased it at a pawn shop in 1980-something. Couldn't afford the family legacy. Yeah, so or, yeah, or he was yeah. looking to replace it after he lost it gambling and before his, grandfa his grandfather found out. Yeah, it was, um... This was... Alright, so you remember, um... Fucking Spencer's Gifts at the mall? How could I not? I mean, that was like... Yeah. So, do you, do you remember, like, the... That like five years where they just sold like now they're just like novelty gifts and crap now. But there was the while where they were like the place to be, like Hot Topic was the place to be, and so. Go to um, this all sounds too familiar. Right. So, <laughs> they, but they they didn't just sell like novelty shit. They just they sold whatever was the hot cool shit to have at the time, and for a while that was katanas. So they sold, like, little shitty dye shows there for, like, 30, 40 bucks. And you could buy them there. And that's basically what this katana set is, or dye show is. Is that it, it's just, like, a little shitty three-piece wannabe Japanese sword set that's, like, steel that's TIG-welded together and, and has some lace wrapped around it. And, like, that's it. It's, Daniel, you got an invite, man. So, okay, uh, awesome. what you're saying is it is dangerous and sharp, just not in the traditional sense. It's mostly because it's a ragged edge. No, no, it's that. That's the thing, though. It's 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 not even dangerous in that manner. Oh, it's like it's only dangerous if you touch it. <laughs> that's exactly what a mall samurai would say. You just you just leave it alone and then. <laughs> So 
uh, what's the next movie coming out? We got to go back to uh, that place. I need a, I need another one of those root beer floats. I'm still thinking about it. Like six weeks later. Um. Well, I'm going out of town next week, but I'll be back in town the week after. Um. <sighs> Okay, okay. Well, uh, I mean, what? It's going to be Captain and Marvel then, at this point, right? That's probably going to be the next thing. Yeah, basically. Yeah. Or Shazam, whichever. Oh, yeah. When does that come out? Comes out like the week after Captain Marvel, I think. Oh, DC. Why do you do this to yourself? Because they don't know what they're doing. And they don't really have a choice. That's the other thing. Like, they don't have a choice. At what point in the like the movie releases for the year can they release a movie to compete with a marvel movie they can't i mean let's just be real it's never going to be it and they are kind of fucked because march comes captain marvel and then april is in game so their best it was either yeah. i don't know i would have said may or february at that point i'd have been like y'all need to make a decision between one or the other cuz um, coming out a week afterwards is a bad choice, but apparently, I mean, I don't know what I'm doing as far as movie marketing. Well, neither do movie marketers. Uh, yeah, I suppose. Ooh, playing Fuse on Hostage. Bold move, Captain. I like it. Thank you, thank you. All right, if you do this wrong, I'm going to play Fuse next time around, and I'm going to show Honestly, you I, how to play Fuse on the hostage. I plan to assert my dominance by immediately fusing the hostage. Exactly. Right, but you can't actually hit the hostage. That's the thing that a lot of Fuses don't understand, is that you're not trying to kill the hostage. You're trying to fuse the hostage room every time and not kill the hostage. It's like Russian roulette. So, well, actually, I mean, you're, you're Russian, so it's just like playing roulette. <laughs> okay, the fun thing is, is that in actuality, in the four years we've been playing this game, that has happened once, where we fused the hostage room, we killed all the defenders, and the hostage was fine. We still don't know how it happened, but it happened. I've, I've fused the hostage room twice without killing the hostage. That is 100% more than I expected, I gotta be honest. Well, 50% more. Well, sorry, it was it was twice in succession. So like once and then a second time without injuring the hostage. No, that's just I, even... I've fused the hostage room... I've fused the hostage room several times and not injured the hostage. You just have to wait for there to be a rather large hostage room and you fuse the other side of it. You know, it's kind of cheating, but you know... Oh, they're downstairs. Hey, Sledge, I think you give me a reset. I missed. Thank you. Something just took me out for how damage. Did you hit an explosive? Oh, yes. Yes, I did. Yeah, I gotta watch those corners. Oh, I hear explosives. Oh, he got me. He got my drone with a C4. There is a uh, there's a captain on the on the door. So how mad will you be if I accidentally kill the hostage? I don't give a shit. I won't care. You're gonna be negative 500 points. So really ask yourself how mad are you gonna be? <laughs> oh, that was cute. I tried to run out and get us. Oh, and he left the game. 
Get dunked on, kid. Ow! Sorry. Daniel, play a charge on that wall. Play a charge on that. Oh, or do that. Good job. Good job. I, I got you, buddy. Don't worry about it. You put me in the down but not out stage and you pick me up. It's, there's a nice symmetry to that, I guess. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I was completing the circle. You're welcome. Wow, that was terrible. Good job, good job.